are going to shoot a film canister rocket all the way up to the ceiling. I am super excited. So to do this, we're gonna need some safety goggles. The main force for our rocket is going to be a chemical reaction. And a chemical reaction is when you take one element and you mix it with another element to create a new substance. In this case, we're gonna be taking water and we are going to mix it with Alka-Seltzer. And we're gonna be creating a gas called carbon dioxide. Now, if we take a look at my beaker right here, we're gonna notice a couple things. We see some bubbles and some foam. And if I listen closely, I hear some hissing and fizzing. And those are all indications to me that a chemical reaction is taking place. In this beaker, the carbon dioxide just leaks out the top and it mixes in with the air all around me. So we're gonna repeat the same chemical reaction, but this time, we're gonna do it in something with a lid. It is very important that the lid to your film canister seals on tightly, otherwise this doesn't work very well. You're also gonna want some kind of pan or dish because this gets a little bit messy. We're gonna go ahead and use the water and we're gonna fill up our film canister. Not all the way because you do need a little bit of space for that carbon dioxide to go. These next steps go super fast. Take a quarter tablet of Alka-Seltzer, drop it in, snap that lid on tight, flip it upside down in your tray, and stand back and watch. And your rocket may take a second to lift off, so you have to be kind of patient. My carbon dioxide was forming. It continued to grow and build and get bigger and bigger and bigger until there was no more space for it, and it had to escape through the weakest part of my film canister which happened to be my lid and created that explosion. Mine didn't quite lift off to the ceiling, but that's okay. Super cool experiment and you can try it at home. Go ahead and change up some variables. Does this work better with hot water or cold water? What happens when you add more Alka-Seltzer? It is totally up to you.